Hello, my name is Desmond Brown. I have built a toolbox that I've been using over the years in my job, and I found it very, very helpful in my work. And what it basically does is holds everything for you. And what's really nice if you have a tool that you're using, you have an empty hole, and then you notice your tool is missing, then you got to get it and put it back in. But basically, it holds a lot of tools in a convenient spot and uh, you can pull things up as you need it. So I'm just gonna go through and show you how many tools I have concentrated in one small area that's very, very handy. You got your spatula, your putty knife, uh, chisel, got my Allen wrench set, got my wire brush, I got my disposal wrench, I got my electrical tester, I got a four-way file, I've got diagonal cutters, I've got wire strippers, I've got needle nose channel locks, and then I've got my wire, my nut drivers all the way from quarter inch to half inch. And I've got some Teflon tape, electrical tape. I got two sets of tweezers, a nice file for cleaning the threads on bolts. Of course, gotta have a crescent wrench. Here's a fine screwdriver with extra bits. Gotta have a razor blade in there. And these are my my files for my drill, my hole reamer, my countersinker. I've got normal vice grips. I've got an ice pick. I've got grease for plumbing, extension for drill bits. I've got masonry bits small screwdriver, diamond cutting bits to cut through a tile and porcelain. I got some special L wrenches I keep, some plumbing tools, an angle driver by Milwaukee fits in there real good, a pair of scissors, all my bits, a nail set, another plumbing wrench, a center punch, large screwdriver, medium screwdriver, long fine screwdriver, and very fine screwdriver. Got a big Phillips screwdriver, normal screwdriver for Phillips and a stubby Phillips standard screwdriver. Got to have a level in there. Got a pair of wire cutters, needle nose, drywall saw, smaller putty knife. We got pliers. We've got channel locks. We've got toothless channel locks. We've got smaller channel locks. We've got a pair of wire strippers plus crimpers. Got a fine hacksaw and of course a drywall knife rat tail file and a spring loaded punch and we have all the bits for driving for your screws and then we have my normal nail set punches and a flashlight when you need it so works very well it's very convenient it's got all this stuff in it and it's very easy all we need to do is sell it with a, a basic box you can sell the top blank or you can sell it pre-drilled if needed and that's just my convenient toolbox that I've been using for years.